Welcome back, Kevin here again. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a fan page on Facebook. Now, along if you go into Facebook and you go to Home, you, along the left menu, you will see this here. Depends on what you have, but you should see Pages and More. Just click More and click Create a Page. Now, from here, you can select whatever you're setting up for. In most cases, it'll probably be a local business company brand or product. It just depends on what you're doing. Um, so in this case, I picked a brand and I put in the recurring income formula, which is the name of the product, um, agreed to the terms, and straight away I was given a fan page. So I'm just going to go to that fan page now, recurring income formula. Now, it was this was blank and it was there was an option here, change cover and upload photo. So all I did was took the header of the site. Now this is relatively easy. All you, if you have no image, you can just create one. Um, all you need is some text, an image, and a background, just plain and simple. And you can see for the profile image, for this case, I actually just used my profile image. I could change that to a logo. Um, I might at some stage. But for this example, this is pretty much perfect the way I want it. It's a fresh page. Um, today is the 25th of June when I'm starting this part of the video. So the next thing what I want to do is I want to go to Woobox. Now Woobox is a free service that you can use to embed uh, HTML and basically embed iframes into your Facebook pages. So you can log in, you can get a free account, just click log in, sign up with Facebook. Now from here, just select the page that you want to work with. And in this case, it's recurrent income formula. And here we go to HTML fan gate and add a fan. Okay, this part is relatively easy. What we do is put page source and URL. So we're going to go back to Elite Group and we're going to create a squeeze page for this offer. Now this again is very quick and simple. We'll just log into Elite Group. And from the menu on the left hand side, you can choose one of the other squeeze pages. I generally like to use the custom background pages for this. Now what I'm doing is I want to create a squeeze page. I want to advertise and send all the traffic to the squeeze page and have my product as the OTO. So I'm going to design, um, just put in a headline for this. So this product, let me see, earn 233,000 this year with a proven formula. Okay, so all I want is to something quick and simple and enter your best email to get started. And I can just make this red. Okay, and I can change this here. We well, could use download now. Okay, and just make that a bit smaller. Perfect. Okay, now I'm just gonna save that page. Ah, sorry, I just need to update my OTO as well. So my OTO for this offer will be the sales page. And just click save. Okay, now I'm just click save. And I'll be able to view the page. Okay, perfect. Now I wanna add a background to this as well or change the backgrounds that are on it. So I'm just gonna use off, off. I'm actually gonna remove the background, just click save again. And refresh. Okay, perfect. Because it's for Facebook, I'm actually going to keep it nice and plain. Now, if I did want to remove email, or sorry, enter your list name from this, um, I can easily do that. In this case, I can just remove the field. Enter your best name. And I can also just remove name here. And click save. Perfect. 
perfect. Okay, now I have my squeeze page ready. So all I want to do is just take this URL here and just go to Woobox and paste it in here. I can hide the scroll bars in this case and click save settings. Okay, the next thing I would like to do here is you can put in a image for the tab. If you go to tab settings, you can put in here free or get access now. Get access now. And I can put in an image if I wish. So just click save settings. Now, the next, I can go to edit and I can click this link here and I'll be able to view this inside Facebook. Now, here you can see, enter two, earn 233,000 this year with a proven formula. So that's actually perfect for my Facebook page. Now, the next thing I need to do is this is the ID which I want and that's what I want to send my traffic to. So when I go to add manager, And I can click create a new ad. I can enter, I can actually put, enter the URL here or choose the recurring income formula and then choose get access now. So all the traffic is going to be sent to that page. Now I'm going to use Kevin Faddy's recurring income formula. Earn up to earn 200. 33k this year click like to get started and I never use sponsored stories so I can remove that now rather than going with a uh, the Facebook normal targeting we can use the group that we that we put together so we can see this one here is uh, for this case here, I'm actually just going to choose the swap group and my leads and I'm going to import the 10k that I had afterwards. I should have did that stuff um, first before going to this step. So, but with the custom audience that you created, um, you, you were, when you import that, which I'll show you in the next step, you just choose that custom audience. Again, I'm just going to choose one of these just for this example. And the countries, I like to put in the most profitable countries. So United States, Canada, New Zealand, Ireland, Australia, United Kingdom. And we can click, we can put our budget at anything we want. Um, to test this out, I'm going to put it at budget at $10 a day. It's probably good to test. So we can review the ad here. This is exactly what it's going to look for. Look, recurring income formula, Kevin Faddy's recurring income formula, earned 230 k this year. Click like to get started. One person likes this. So it's actually an okay ad. I could change this image around, which I probably will. But I can just place order now and your ad was successfully, it will start running once it's approved. So that's how you get your ad set up. Now I'm just gonna go to audiences and show you how to import that list. If you go to your power editor, now inside the power editor, you will see audiences. You can go create an audience. So what I do is custom audience and I'm gonna give this a name, recurring income leads. Now, and the description, we get the same again. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna choose the file which I saved, then 10,000 leads. So I just have to go find that file. And we will see recurring income and UIDs, which is the Facebook IDs and click create. You will see that it takes one to two hours for your audiences to be imported. And that's basically how you target. So you just go back and you choose that target audience when you're targeting people. You will see in the other example that I was doing, I choose these groups. Um, as soon as this audience is approved, I will go in and choose these. And that way I'll be able to target them 10,000 people only for my offer. Okay, so that's all I'm going to cover in this training video. So thank you.